Welcome to the Honda Power Equipment video, Maintaining Your Versatach Powerhead. In this video, we'll show you how to properly perform maintenance steps on your Honda Versatach Powerhead. For information regarding the attachments for the Versatach system, take a look at our separate videos for the attachments. Gasoline-powered engine exhaust contains carbon monoxide, which is a poison you can't see or smell. Never operate a gasoline-powered engine inside an enclosed area. Operating the power head can be dangerous if used improperly. Always refer to the owner's manual for additional information regarding the proper setup and operation of your power head. Changing the engine oil according to the maintenance schedule in the owner's manual is an important step to keeping the gasoline engine on the Versatech power head trouble free for many years. First confirm that the fuel cap is tightened securely. Place a suitable container below the engine portion of the power head near the oil filler cap area. Remove the engine oil filler cap and set aside. Now tip the power head toward the filler neck and allow the engine oil to drain completely. Notice that draining the oil when the engine is warm helps drain the engine quickly and completely. Please dispose of the used engine oil in a responsible manner according to your local laws and regulations. Set the power head on a flat level surface using a funnel and fill the engine with 10W30 oil. Note that the UMC425 takes about 2.7 ounces of oil and the UMC435 takes about 3.3 ounces of oil. Fill the engine oil to the bottom edge of the oil fill hole. Reinstall the oil filler cap securely and wipe any spilled oil. Cleaning and oiling the engine air filter according to the owner's manual can help prevent dirt or debris from entering the engine, which can cause rapid engine wear or engine damage. To begin servicing the air filter, set the power head on a flat level surface. Move the choke lever to the closed or upward position. Remove the air cleaner cover by squeezing the two upper tabs together as shown to release the cover. Rotate the cover downward and set aside. Remove the air filter and inspect for damage and replace if necessary. To begin cleaning the air filter, set the air filter into a container with warm, soapy water to remove any dirt, debris, or contaminants from the filter foam. Once cleaned, allow the air filter to dry thoroughly before oiling again. Once the filter has dried completely, place it in a resealable bag with a small amount of engine oil. Close the bag and work the oil into the filter by gently massaging as shown. Remove the filter from the bag and firmly pat dry to remove excess oil. Before reinstalling the air filter, use a clean rag to wipe the air filter cover and the air filter base of any dirt or debris. Reinstall the filter then the air filter cover by aligning the lower tabs, then insert the upper tabs firmly until locked in place. Inspecting and, if necessary, replacing of the spark plug according to your owner's manual is critical to the proper operation of the Versatech power head. Before servicing the spark plug, be sure that the engine is not running and has cooled. To begin servicing the spark plug, set the power head on a flat level surface then using the supplied 6mm hex wrench, loosen and remove the engine top cover and set it aside. Disconnect the spark plug cap by pulling upward away from the engine and push to the side. Clean any dirt or debris from around the spark plug area. Use the supplied spark plug wrench or a 5 8 inch socket to loosen and remove the spark plug. Measure the spark plug electrode gap using a commercially available gap gauge and adjust the gap if necessary. The spark plug gap should be between 0.6 and 0.7 millimeters. Replace the spark plug if the electrode is worn, damaged, fouled, or if the sealing washer is damaged or missing. Install the spark plug by hand and thread it until it stops. Once seated, tighten the spark plug an additional half of a turn if the spark plug is new and 1 8 to 1 quarter of a turn if reinstalling a used spark plug. Once tightened, reinstall the spark plug cap, followed by the engine cover in the reverse order of removal. 
Each VersaTach attachment has its own video regarding operation, maintenance, and storage. Be sure to watch the video for your specific attachment for any maintenance that may be recommended. For additional information regarding the maintenance of your VersaTach powerhead, refer to your owner's manual or contact your Honda Power Equipment dealer. Thank you.